bus is shifting into high gear before sunrise signals the start of the 2015-16 school year. With the dawning of the new school year comes more than 70 additional buses and new transportation technology. The district's Find My Bus Stop feature at palmbeachschools.org allows caregivers who register to locate their child's bus stop and even track the bus via GPS as it travels along its route. Well, we want to be able to give the parents and uh, caregivers some information where they can go into their computer and see where the bus is, if it's running on time or any types of delays that come up. The new school year also begins with a new school leader, Superintendent Robert Avosa, who greeted transportation staff on their first day. Students at Lincoln Elementary greeted the new school year with enthusiasm. Um, on the first day of school, we don't get to um, we don't get to do work and we get to play. Will that be a good day? Yes. This school was one of several in the district to host a Million Father March, a project which encourages male caregivers to take their children to school on the first day. Dr. Avosa joined in the effort. You think fourth grade is going to be easy or hard? The superintendent also joined children for breakfast. All students in the district are invited to power up with a free breakfast every day. Proper nutrition is just one part of the recipe for a successful school experience. We'll start the school year off with a great attitude. Make sure you get yourself organized. Uh, put patterns in place so you know when you get home from school what kind of homework needs to be done, where all that stuff is you need uh, for the next day. Make sure you're organized and you know just come to school ready to learn. You're going to need rubber gloves. Students throughout the district now have more career and choice options than ever. Dr. Avosa visited Grassy Waters Elementary School where he toured the school's new biomedical and veterinary program. This program is one of 13 new academic programs that the district added this year to its list of nearly 300 such programs. At Congress Middle School, Dr. Avosa chatted with students and staff over lunch. At Olympic Heights High School, students in the new Marines ROTC program greeted classmates, faculty, and Dr. Avosa. Sixteen schools, such as Lakeshore Middle School in Belle Glade, will be led by new principals this year. I want the students to win. Not only win in school, I want them to win in the community, I want them to win in life. Students and staff in the Glades are also buzzing about two rebuilt and remodeled schools, Gladeview Elementary School in Belle Glade and Rosenwald Elementary in South Bay. Transitioning into the new school year is now easier than ever for students and parents thanks to the district's new Back to School webpage. Log on to palmbeachschools.org slash back to school for information about everything from school registration to cafeteria menus to health requirements and more. For students and staff, the new school year represents a fresh start in which anything is possible. Claudia Shea reporting for the Education Network, keeping you informed.